start now please continue Manudin sir can you be a little bit louder please yeah 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 because your voice is so slow okay 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 we can start now i'm little bit okay. sick that's why my voice is a little i think so i uh, oh. i'm trying to adjust now okay ma'am we can start now okay oh, imran khan yeah can okay. i start now okay sure okay what topic would you like I like to focus happiness. Happiness, okay. No problem. Uh, do you think happiness is connected to health? Sorry, wealth. Sorry. Hello? Sorry. Can you repeat? Do you it? think? Yeah, of course. Do you think happiness is connected to wealth? Okay. Actually, to me, happiness uh, doesn't mean wealth. Uh, um, wealth uh, doesn't mean happiness. Wealth is not uh, uh, exactly what you mind to be happiness. I think sometimes I think. Okay. Uh, but your voice is slow. What? Okay. What things uh, make you happy? Okay. Actually, I'm not. Uh happy with any uh, particular things uh, but a little uh, love and nice uh, talk is enough to keep me happy hello yeah boom. your answer is over yeah Oh, okay. How do you cheer yourself up when you are down? Mm. Question number five. How do you cheer yourself up when you are down? Oh, he has gone. Hello? Hello, Deepa ma'am. Ibrahim, sir? Yes, uh, I can hear. Okay. How are you? I'm good. And you? Yeah, I'm well also. Uh, okay, uh, Imran Khan is here now. So... Yeah. Can I ask you again? Okay, sure. Okay. What things make you happy? Oh my God, he has gone again. <laughs> okay. Who wants to answer now? Hello, guys. Who wants to answer now? Sorry? Who wants to answer now? Actually, Mankan has gone. So, yeah, you can ask me. Oh, okay. Can I ask you randomly or you want to uh, like to another topic? Uh... No, your choice. You can ask. Oh, okay. Okay. Do you think happiness is connected to wealth? Sometimes it's connected to wealth, but in general, there is a difference between them. Because 
happiness is a feeling of of our minds. There sometimes will create uh, problems, and we, uh, and for that uh, sometimes we become very unhappy. Uh, in the point of poor people, they are um, they are always want of money. So when they get some money, they feel uh, so happy. At that point of view, you can say that uh, well, this uh, happiness for uh, those people who need them. Otherwise, uh, it's not impact any way uh, to our happiness. Yes, ma'am. Uh, so, do you think happiness is connected to love? Of course, it is directly connected to love. Because uh, you can you can make someone happy when you love him, when you support him. Um, so I think uh, love is directly connected to happiness. Yes, ma'am, I agree with you. Um, how would you define happiness? Happiness is something is a very complicated. Yeah, uh, so right. Happiness is uh, a feeling. Happiness is a feeling of our minds. It's just like a butterfly. When you uh, uh, when you run after it, it flew away. You can't touch it. You can't catch it. So, uh, uh, so if you stand still and uh, and keep patience, then the happiness comes to your hand. So, I think um, uh, the. The definitions of happiness depends different uh, mentality and uh, different types of people. You can uh, define it a fixed definition. So I just, uh, in my point of view, I think happiness is um, a strong feeling of our mind, which makes um, us happy uh, through uh, good news, or uh, or some things that uh, that gives you charms. Yes, ma'am. What things make you happy? Any kinds of good news. It may be from my family or from my uh, countries uh, when they win prizes, get hours or becomes a uh, very good positions in the international uh, level. That's make me so happy. Yeah, ma'am. Uh, then, why do some people find it difficult to achieve happiness? As I um, said that, happiness is just like a butterfly. People when try to catch it, they feel very difficult. And uh, they always uh, try to make themselves happy, but uh, they don't feel that what they have, they should find happiness in there. But they don't try that. They think that happiness uh, lives on the uh, on the other side of the river. So that's uh, makes so difficult for those people who are trying to be happy. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Uh, how do you cheer yourself up when uh, you are down? Okay. When I was a school going girl, when my mood becomes off, then I went to a shop and buy some janitors and uh, chops some frying things and crispy things, like chips, and uh, eat them. Then uh, when I finish them, then my, uh, my mind feels so happy and I am feel relaxed. But nowadays, uh, when my mind is so off or down, then I start to read novels, uh, listen songs, and doing other household works.
and makes me uh, they makes me happy okay is there a lot of crime in your country yeah uh, we can't ignore it but really in our country in our society in every stage we have a lot of crimes like um, crimes uh, also exist in our home too some uh, families have uh, violence family violence family crisis they also are just like a crime um, uh, and uh, now uh, nowadays it's uh, corona time it's very pandemic time and uh, those people who are very very poor and, and have no work some they are engaged in some such kind of crimes not all the people but some are um, are engaged in the crime and also you can find um, in um, the crimes in our government jobs also like the corruptions we can't ignore it it's just like the crime and so on and so many things also present there yeah is there anything which is not a crime but should be um no i don't uh, know about that okay if you, uh, you if you are familiar with it uh, you can share i don't know okay ma'am i think uh, i think uh, there are a lot of things which are uh, which is crime but shouldn't be that uh, shouldn't be like uh, a lot of things like a uh, crime which is very a crime i think but i don't know a specific what is okay ma'am okay mm -hmm. uh but we can uh, we can say uh, most of our drivers uh, a lot of drivers and then a lot of people doing a bad bad work or bad things which, uh, which they shouldn't do I think uh, yeah yeah okay uh, why do people become criminals um, people become criminals <clears throat> yeah there have lots of reasons it's maybe a uh, poverty a bunch of money they always need a bunch of money and when they are very idle some people are idols and some people are trying to uh, engage or get a job but when they fail they uh, they need uh, money to their life livelihood so they have to choose some criminal works and also you can say the unemployment problem uh, family crisis and uh, proper educations and also bad gambling. They also makes people uh, to be to uh, to do crime. I think so. And there there are also some another reasons why people choose the crime. Um, but I am not familiar with them. But uh, grossly, I know that. That's the uh, that's the why people engage in crime. Yeah, ma'am. Uh, then our next question is: uh, Is there anything which is sorry? Is there anything which is not a crime but should be? Um. No, I don't know. Yeah, ma'am, this question is so difficult, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, some countries are leg uh, legalizing drugs. Is, uh, is this a good or bad thing? Uh, 
for this purpose, I want to tell a very short story about that. Uh, one day a baby came and said a very decent uh, person that I have give you two, uh, uh, two points that you have to choose one between them. So Perry to, uh, told to the man that first uh, um, you take drug and another is you have to kill your pa parents. So this decent man thought that uh, ki my, uh, killing my uh, killing parents is very sin and I have to <clears throat> I have to get punished from my God. So it is uh, very better if I uh, take the drug. Uh, he also knows that the drug is also a very crime and it's not uh, good. So he thought that um, um, uh, taking drugs is less sin than killing parents. Then he uh, took this drug and that's, uh, and after that what? He became drunk and killed his parents. So what's the morality of this story? This morality is that drug is the supreme crime of all the sins or all the crimes. So I am not um, eager with uh, those developed countries, but they legalize the drug. I'm not uh, angry with them. Because okay. uh, yeah, I have said yeah. that <coughs> really the drug is very, very old thing. Yeah. Okay. Our next question is, do you think punishments for criminals in your country are too strict, too lenient, or just right? Okay, thank you. Um, you know that uh, our uh, the constitutions of our country is the very good and you can say that it is one of the best constitutions of the world, but it's uh, very, uh, very sad that uh, we have not applications of this constitutions law, constitutions law, and most of the people of our country are not uh, are not familiar with our constitutions and uh, also our laws. So, though we have a strong, strong laws about the crimes, but they are not properly used. So, at first, we have to uh, uh, impose them to our people to know and aware of the law and uh, and and put this law very strictly, because. Uh, because nowadays you will say that uh, people do crime and uh, even uh, they uh, get a punishment and and lived very quickly. That's the power of our uh, very important person. So I think that our laws is very good, but they are not strictly used. They only used them to the poor con uh, poor people but not the uh, powerful people. Powerful people always uh, uh, escape from this, uh, from the punishment. And the poor people suffer much. So it should be uh, applied uh, throughout the whole people strictly, I think. Yeah, ma'am, you're right. So thank you so much for you answering these questions. So can I go to another person now? I think we have done with thank these questions. You for your okay. questions. Okay, ma'am. Welcome. So Ibrahim Mandal sir and Manuddin sir here. Manuddin sir. Manuddin sir, can you hear me? Hello, sir. Manutin, sir, are you here? Hello. Hello, Manutin, sir. Okay, Ibrahim Mandal, sir, can you hear me? 
Yeah, ma'am, I'm hearing. Okay, sir. Uh, Deepa, ma'am, I request you to ask uh, Ibrahim Mandal, sir, these questions. Um, how are you? Yeah, Alhamdulillah, I'm great. What about you, ma'am? Sorry, your voice is so low. You can't hear him? Yeah, now I can hear you. So I'm asking you some questions. Yeah. May I? Sure, ma'am, please. Okay. Uh, do you think happiness is connected to wealth? Obviously, it's hundred percent true. Questions. Happiness always help to uh, happiness always help to mind and mind help to health. Uh, I think I have said that wealth. Is it wealth? Yeah, wealth. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Do you think happiness is connected to love? This is hundred percent true. How happiness? How you would need say happiness. Yeah, uh, happiness is your curious to do something. You have no happiness. You you mind your uh, like uh, your. Uh, Anything you can do because you, you're not happy and you can't anything your work uh, fulfill your uh, full focus in anything any kind of work. So you need must be happiness and when you're happy, then you you feel up you feel any type of works love. There will be loves. Oh. I think so. Yeah, I agree with you. So, what things make you happy? Yeah, that's nice questions. Thank you. Actually, um, happy is that I think happy is to uh, feel like honest. When you like to do something honest work, then, then this times you feel happy. And... Um, <laughs> Yeah, when you help some people, when you help some any types of works to another, uh, like uh, any types of uh, uh, any types of works, this is, is still need to our um, world. Yeah, this times to uh, you feel make happy. Hey. So obviously, uh, obviously happy is. Uh, yeah, your mind to always think be positive, then you will be happy. Okay, you are uh, so what? Hello, yeah, ma'am. Yeah, ma'am. Is there any problem in the screen? I think, yeah, yeah, now it's okay. Okay. Yes, your um, answer is so good. And I appreciate with you. So how do you cheer up yourself when you are down? Okay, that's nice questions. Actually, um, when you do some mistakes, then will be um, then will be crush your happiness. But when you be uh, go to working, then will be um, confident you you anything do something. So when when you will be some do work, then will be um, it, it, when you some do work to like your family. You, you want to some sort of work to like your, your family, then your family will be happy, then you will be happy. So I think 
yeah there's that it will be good to happy to your uh, any types of um, uh, happy to share your family then you will be serves okay. so why people uh, feel it's very difficult to get happiness actually it as if to um, positive and negative so yeah, there are lots of work. Uh, yeah, do you know this is our uh, one of the most uh, negatives or negatives work in our in country. There's politic politicians that do work some lots of uh, negative uh, lots of uh, negative works in my area, also in a country. So yeah, it's difficult because the work is negative. But if you uh, do work some, do, uh, if you do do some work in our our um, any types of work, do something uh, positively, and they work the uh, they work the honestly, then it's it's a so uh, not a difficult to achieve happiness. But when you like uh, wrong way. When they do some work wrong way, it's difficult for you. But uh, yeah, it's still you are doing like a, uh, any types of work uh, positively, and there are some not of uh, not uh, like a, any types of so not uh, negative. Yeah, th this will be uh, make happiness, and it will be di not difficult to achieve your happiness. But you must be think, and you must be too positive. It will be um, help to achieve your happiness. Well done. Your answer is yes, ma'am. Ma so good. Yes, ma'am. Ma yes, sir. Okay. You're yes, taking sir. A, lo a little longer. I think it's better if you finish in five minutes. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay. Yeah. Thank you, 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 you can take your time. Okay. Continue. Just remember. So, may I go to the crime topic? Okay, sure. Why do people become criminals? Yeah, this is another nice question. So, uh, do you know the people can be uh, can be tied to like uh, do something negative? But she, he or she is just the first time think be positive and do something. But uh, they are naturals uh, are doing uh, doing some uh, better work, and that will be criminals. Okay. And, and there are also lots of problem in our country. Okay, is there a lot of crimes in your country? Yeah, do you know these crimes in positions in our country, like in top 10? So, yeah, obviously. Can you tell some it's crimes? There's a lot of crime in the can my country. Labor crimes in your country? Yeah, there's a lot. Yeah, there's a lot of crimes. Like uh, any, do you know, you live also in Bangladesh and you also citizens in Bangladesh. You know that, all everything. Who is uh, like any types of uh, area, any types of work? There are lots of um, crimes. There are lots of uh, um, negative issue. So you, well, when you feel some, you uh, sometimes you say like a free freedoms. You have never freedoms in this country. You you just say anything. Our government. Um, you say just anything uh, negatively in our government. It will be crime in our new situations. The police will arrest you. Okay. Yeah, that will be so 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 affected in our uh, social area. Is there anything which is a crime, but uh, shouldn't be? Hello, ma'am. Uh, actually, I want to uh, say one thing. Can I? Yeah, sure, ma'am. Of course, ma you can. Okay, uh, uh, actually our meeting will be ended uh, within a few minutes. So you need to be uh, returned, okay? Okay. Okay, no problem.
you can continue now okay okay ma'am so you want a question as before yes, sir yeah or three is there anything which is a crime but shouldn't be okay yeah that's nice questions and i think do you know this is a uh, lots of people full people in work in like uh, any types of so uh, put sticks uh, like uh, any types of nearby robots any types of yeah the um, and do you know there's a, okay. uh, many types of poor people work in like a, um make some uh, i didn't remember this word like what's the mean tokai okay. ma'am yes what's the what's the meaning in bangla english in tokai i forget this word okay tokai i don't know sir she i think, I, also. I, I, think I, I, I think uh fazla hasan abid sir is the founder of tokai uh, this word i think it's a uh, acceptable uh word uh, in wall yeah 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 i think it is true to guy is the two guy yeah i'm sorry teacher may i help you yeah yeah sir please sure yeah please, please sir please wa alaikum wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullah sorry to interrupt all guys i think i have to apologize everyone we have to come in this meeting late and it shouldn't be happen because all you people are very uh, sincere and you have joined all the time at 710 but i have joined uh, i always been joined here uh, 30 minutes that that should happen and, and believe me we are not but my some limitations i have already shared with uh, yeah, sir, I think your network is so poor. I can't hear you properly. Yeah, sir, do you hear me? I also can't hear him. Sir, are you there? Yeah, uh, that was my network issue. Yeah, I think. Are so, you sir. hearing me now? Yeah, you, you are an audible, sir. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry to cutting you off in the midst of your talking. That you you were just asking that what's the English meaning of Tokai? You can say a street child or yes, street children. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, I also I also use this word street child and this word, but I think there's any time of synonyms. And I forget this word. Okay, you can continue. Okay, sir. Okay. Thank you for your service. Um, can I go to the next question? Yeah, ma'am, please. Some ma countries are uh, been... utilizing drugs. Ma'am, I think we have a time short. So you want to ask to like uh, another two, two person here. So you want to ask to another person. Um, they will be good. Okay. And I have okay. done one one options. So you wanna ask to another, like we have another two persons. Okay. Want to answer? Please. Can you hear me? Yeah. We all hear you. Wanna, you want to ask to Hassan Prachar? Yeah, okay, hello, so. ma'am. Ma'am, you yes. asked all, uh, already. I think it's better if uh, uh, now, uh, if another person who didn't ask uh, at all, uh, he ask, he can ask now. I think it's better. Um, yes, 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 you are right. Yeah. Okay. okay, now uh, here, uh, my Nuddin sir and Ibrahim Mandel didn't ask uh, also. 
Okay, so, Ibrahim, I'm good, sir. Sir. You... Ibrahim sir, I request yes, sir. you to ask for Hathasan sir. Can you? Okay, sir. Okay, okay thank sir. you very thank much. You. Thank you. Continue, please. So, for your, Adun, your time sir, how is are you? Only 20 minutes. Okay, yeah, Assalamu alaikum. I'm, I'm pretty well. How about you, brother? Yeah, Alhamdulillah. I'm doing great. And uh, how is going Ramadan, sir? Yeah, my Ramadan is going uh, very good because uh, I'm trying to spend uh, whatever time I have got uh, to uh, make it meaningful. And I don't know whether my prayers are uh, going to Allah or not, but I'm trying. So uh, you can say wh whatever time I'm getting, I'm trying to just make it meaningful. And you know that uh, we have only uh, 12 or 13 days in our hand. So uh, I think the Ramadan is going to end. So we all should have uh, uh, made, uh, made this Ramadan more meaningful. Thank you very much. And <clears throat> I'm very happy after seeing that you all are so, so considerate the, the two ma'ams, uh, they are uh, wanting to ask that, uh, to give the question answering session over to you uh, both. And you both members are trying to give the chance to each other. That's very great. Thank you very much. Okay, you can ask question. Okay, thank you, sir, for your opinion. And inshallah, we will swing to our work, continue to another people. Thank you for your answers. Uh, thank you for your um everything so sir i have questions to you some students uh, do you know this is topics x uh, like uh, happiness and another topic is crime so uh, which topics you want to answer you want to answer to me okay thank you very much for giving me chance to choose uh, one of the two topics and if as we have a short time so i will choose crime Okay, that's me. cool. So, okay, okay, sir. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna ask to like uh, one question, uh, sir. Um, uh, uh, why do people become a uh, crimes? Criminals. Okay. Okay. Thank so you very crim much. Criminals or crimes is I think so same synonyms. Okay. Uh, if you don't mind, can I can I make it clear to you? Yeah, sure, sir. Crime, yes, sure, sure sir, please. For crime, the crime is verb. But whenever... Oh, yeah, I, I, I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it, I got it. Okay, I think you, you already yeah, I got it, know sir. that. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I'm here also. Okay, sir. Yeah, I want to ask you um, again. This question number one is why people become criminals. Okay, thank you very much for asking these questions. Uh, question, as you know that uh, my belief is that no person in this world have born um, as criminal. I think uh, this is the society or this is the environment which forces him to become criminal. Yeah, some you can say that uh, there is also some debate about this position, about my position, because you can also say that some people have criminal mind, so they would like to criminal in their life from the early childhood. In the in the in various films, we have seen that uh, the the criminal mind wants to be uh, wants to do the criminal deeds. And uh, yeah, I have to also admit that it's also a uh, influential reason be, uh, behind uh, the people become criminals. But I think most of the people become criminals uh, for the environments or for their surroundings, which forces them uh, to be criminals because uh, sometimes um, he, is, he or she uh, bounds to do that or uh, sometimes uh, he or she will uh, play of the situation. So it depends on the situation. So I think there is uh, no, there are no other definite reasons that why do people become criminals? It depends on many factors. Thank you. 
Okay, sir. Thank you. Thank you. So your sum explains uh, like uh, why it people uh, becomes a crimes. Yeah, that's a nice answer. And uh, yeah, so I wanna go to another questions. Um, this is there anything which is not a crime but should be? Okay, uh, you know that in our country, especially this question is very much related with our country or with the societal environment of our country. You know that in our country, uh, which are regarded as crime, that is bravery, that is uh, killing, that is hijacking, thief, dacoity, or robbery, uh, these are called as uh, these are called as crimes, but you know there's some other things which is more uh, I think more popular in our society, but we don't uh, regard this as a crime. Rather, we are uh, accepting this as a normal behavior. That is what that is. That is backbiting, whatever backbiting. I think uh, as a Muslim. You, you also know that in our religion, backbiting is prohibited. And it has been compared with, uh, with your dead brother's flesh. You know that, the backbiting in Islam. And also in all, in all religion, I know that in all religion, backbiting is, an, is a, a dis, a disencouraged in all religion. So, but in our country, backbiting is a normal phenomenon. This shouldn't be happened. And uh, to my point of view, it's a crime. So that is the thing which is a crime, but it shouldn't be. Thank you. Okay, sir, your question so clear to why these people are uh, um, doing some crimes in our society. Yeah, that's nice uh, answer. And uh, yeah, I want a question to be another. So, uh, do you think um, punishments for criminals in your country are too strict, or too lanes, or just right? Okay. Uh, I think in my country, in Bangladesh, or this is not problem of Bangladesh, because if I can only answer these questions, though these questions are regarded with my country, uh, I have to answer well, with the situation uh, and uh, taking the consideration of the situation of my country. But I think this problem is related with this uh, continent, subcontinent, especially because all the people of this subcontinent, uh, they have possessed the same behavior. They have possessed the same behavioral pattern. And that's the problem. Yeah, now I'm going to the uh, center. That is, I'm going to the answer directly going to the answer of this question that in my country, criminals uh, in uh, my country are too strict or punishment for the criminals uh, are too strict or too lenient or just right. I think in my country, this is in mid position. You know that. So recently, or I, can, I can explain it by giving a, 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 a real example. You, you have already been know that, you all know that, there, there is an accident has been happened. There is an incident has been uh, occurred by a renowned uh, group, uh, that by an MD of a renowned group. Uh, I, I have to say the name because it's a private group, Boshundara group. The MD of Boshundara group has been convicted with uh, uh, a suicidal case of a young lady. You all know that. So what will happen in this case we all know that in this case, there will be no justice because from the very beginning, our law enforcing authority have intention not to give the proper uh, judgment or uh, proper justice to the, uh, to the victim person or victim family, rather they want to make it the, uh, their way of making money. Because you know that in this case, the convicted person is our so rich people. So if you can convict them with much proof or something like that, then you can earn more money. That's the main motto 
of our law enforcing authority. I have to say sorry for that, but that's the real fact. That's the fact. Now, so from, for, for people like him, for people like the upper class in my country, the punishment for criminals, punishments for criminals are lenient. That is, they can easily escape from any kind of uh, crime. And there, is, uh, there are much opportunities, there are much loopholes in our uh, law legal system. As, as I'm also a student of legal background, I know that what are the loopholes in our legal system? So you can, you can also get anticipatory bail that is in Bengali, uh, you can get Agam Jamin, anticipatory bail after doing a crime. So this shouldn't be happened. This, should, this system should be banned. And this system is designed only for the upper class of our country. Now, the punishments, I have also, I, I'm also saying that our, in our country, the punishment systems uh, are in mid, mid, mid position. That is for what, uh, for why I'm telling this, because for the general people like, uh, like me, like you, if you do any kind of, any kind of wrong deed or any kind of wrong thing, then you will understand how strong our punishment of a crime is. How strong? Because for you and me, for general people, it will, it, they, will, uh, they will just uh, give you the highest paramount punishment. So I have to say, first of all, the, this question has three segments. That is whether the punishments are too strict. No, the punishments are not too strict. To some extent, it's more lenient, and is uh, to some extent uh, there there is uh, no system of punishment for the upper class of the society. And the other side, I have to say, yes, the punishments are strict for whom, for the lower class, or for the general people like us, for the middle class. And is it right? No, is it, this is not right system because in a right society, the punishment of the legal system would bring justice for all the people of the society. But in our country, we know that if you have money, then you can buy the legal system. If you haven't money, you can't escape from that. And for that, we have to hard, we have to many times, we have to hear the news of Josnia, or we have to, you know, many times we have heard that some um, uh, uh, innocent person have got jail for the wrongdoings of others. So this, uh, I think that this is the loopholes, these are the loopholes of our legal system. Thank you. I'm taking quite a bit, a uh, long time for answering this question, but I, I think I have to take that time for the better clarification. Thank you. Okay, sir, no problem. You, you don't take your time, so no problem. You have a time. So yeah, you, you just clear uh, our today's uh, um, questions uh, like, um, some uh, yeah sir yeah I'm I wanna I wanna go to another questions to you, sir. What about thing today's in our country uh, about um, drugs like uh, legals or illegals? What about thing? Okay, so uh, first of all, we have to understand that what are the uses of the drugs. Uh, uh, most often we think that. Drugs are bad, aren't we? We always think that drugs are bad, but the reality is that drugs are not always bad because to fight against any disease, to uh, build up your um, preventive system of your body, you need to take drugs sometimes. And whenever we, are, we fall in illness in that time, Drug can save us. Uh, the real fact is, yeah, Allah SWT will save us, but drug will heal you, the pain. Now, the main fact is that, that is, is this legal or is this legal, uh, is this, uh, legal to uh, make legalized of drugs in our country? Is it a bad thing or good thing? But main fact is that countries like Bangladesh, should don't legalize the drugs because here uh, you see we are an insane nation 
I have, I'm sorry to say that, but we, I have to say that we are an insane nation. Insane nation because we are, the, we are such nations who are taking the drugs for addiction. You know about, you, uh, you, you have heard about Fancidil. Do you know what it is? Fancidil is a, a medicine for cough. And our young generations or our old people who are uh, engaging in uh, uh, addiction, they are taking this as uh, for their addiction. So uh, aren't we insane? Yeah, we must, we, I must say we are insane. And I also, uh, I have also come to know that some other drugs which are used only for our illness purpose or only for our uh, business purpose, those kinds of medicines are also used uh, for addiction or uh, for drug addiction. So for our country, legalizing drugs will not better. Better in our country, the present situation, that uh, restriction on the drugs, I think uh, this is the best measure. And we have to maintain this because in our country, people are not uh, enjoying, people can't capable of enjoying the independence because in our country. So we, we should have to, uh, uh, have to captive, we should have to restrict our people about drugs. Thank you. Yes, sir, you're absolutely right. Uh, I, I, I also agree with you. And so do you know our countries, uh, some people um, like uh, when uh, these uh, drugs used to mis mis misused, so it will uh, it it is so uh, um, harmful in our uh, like uh, uh, society. So yeah, you're absolutely right. And uh, yeah, sir, I think I finished like uh, one part. And yeah, my not then, sir. Okay, I am here. Okay, sir, I uh, I think you should continue, but you have a long time. Uh, remaining uh, on uh, uh, about five minutes so please continue okay sir thank you okay hassan uh, Farad, sir i want to ask hey. you some questions uh, of me and uh, yeah i'm um you want some advice like uh, I don't speak like uh, fluently. I, I, I can't uh, like uh, re remain some uh, remember some word into like a vocabulary. And yeah, I, I know this. Uh, this is my weak weak point. And you, you just touched um, some um, some real some topics. Uh, anything you just uh, suggest us how to improve our all everything about English. Okay, thank you very much. First of all, I'm privileged. I'm feeling privileged that you are uh, you were wanting suggestion from me. And though I'm, I'm feeling that I'm not uh, that old, because I'm also learning. And um, we are uh, moreover, we are all a study partner. Uh, so if you feel that I'm, I have the answer or answers of your question, that is, how can you build up your vocabulary or how can you? Uh, build up your fluency level that I think, uh, okay, I can help you that what I am following, first of all, uh, to, to uh, enrich your vocabulary, you have to find out, first of all, you have to maintain uh, a notebook to copy them. Try to collect five or six words, at least five words every day, at least five words. And if you can, if you can more than that, that will be best. And if you can't get any time, okay, try to find out only five or six words from your real life like that. Okay, I will give you an example. Like that, uh, we often say that, oh, I'm a couple of wrong legs here. So how can you say, how can you, uh, say it in English, that is wrong laga. That is, uh, how can you wrong utanu? So this kind of English, this kind of real life English, you have to collect. Anybody, if you ask uh, or someone, they will say that, okay, go to read the what is smart one, go to read the 
GRE books, go to read the GMAT books. No, this is not needed for your daily life English because you want to learn English for using this in your daily life, in your real life. We are, we are in through our uh, full study life. We have learned so many things, but how many things have you been able to um, act or uh, to make it successful in your real life? I think a few things. So you have to collect the real life word and please note it down in your notebook. And that notebook, you have to maintain a space, try to uh, write three or three words in a page. Now, then your task is go to the online dictionary, any dictionary, Oxford dictionary, Collins Cobble dictionary, search that word. After getting that word, searching that word, then you will find some sentences. And if you uh, collect the, those sentences from Oxford or from Collins Cobble dictionary, it, there will be the genuine sentences. So you should, what, now what is your task? You have to write down those sentences related to bad words you have written in your notebook. Only three or four sentences, just write down those, those sentences beside your word. Then you will just utter them, you will read out them. Your task is over. Now you have to do one more thing. Now use that word by and and you have to make your own sentence in the allot in, in a separate notebook. You have to maintain a separate notebook for you, just make just doing your uh, practicing work. So now you have to make at least five sentences with that word. And this is the best way to just me not memorize, to just set up the word in your brain. And in this way, you will not forget that word. I must, I ensure you, I ensure you follow this. So this is the only way of learning vocabulary. You have to give more labor, brother. Okay, but sir. I think if you follow yes, sir, this- I got it. And second, for listening, yeah, yeah, sir. Yeah. what you should do. I think you shouldn't do yes, sir. any You're right. things. You have to just, just listen some, first of all, TESOL has provided us 25 audiobooks. I think you all have that, 25 audiobooks. First of all, you have to complete that books because in that books, you will find the audio clips also. In that audio clips, they will uh, they have altered all the word very, very slowly. So what is your task? You have to follow their style of art of the word, their style of pronunciation. Yeah, so yes, you sir, you are right. And we, we you do you know this uh, few times, uh, Nico, we just uh, doing some other groups, this, uh, this audio, about this audio books, we're yeah. doing some works there. And yeah, you are right. And yeah, thank you for your suggest. And inshallah, I'm trying to, and we are all, all, all guys trying to do something, uh, your advice. And thank you, sir share your advice and okay. yeah this is so um grateful okay. to you and maradin sir are you here yeah 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 uh Hassan, sir i uh, have a request Hassan, sir hello sir i'm i'm here yes okay sir i request you to uh answer uh miss sharmin can you sir Okay, Sherman, ma'am, you can ask me a question. No, sir, you just ask to Sharmin, ma'am. I think so. Oh, I have to ask Sharmin, ma'am, but uh, brother, um, and ma'am, all of you, from all of you, I have to take leave because it's uh, 8.21 and I have only nine minutes in my hand because at 8.30, I have to attend the Isha Sala. And uh, yeah, I'm sir, very sorry. And Okay, yes, sir. I'm also, I think I need to also leave, but you I have a nine that, minutes, and no I have a, like four minutes because our our salat is start at uh, twenty five. Eight thirty. So, yeah. Okay, sir. So, no problem. You can uh, you can take leave. 
no problem okay yes, sir okay, thank, thank you for joining happy learning yeah, happy okay. learning and thank you so much okay allah hafiz assalamu alaikum allah hafiz wa alaikum assalam and inshallah i will try tomorrow i will surely join on time inshallah okay, okay. and advance thank you sir okay manuddin sir i want to say something about uh, like uh, this um uh, yeah i i just send some uh, yeah topics to you personally okay sir okay okay sir thank you thank you uh sharmin ma'am do you hear me can you hear me sharmin ma'am hello hello yeah i can hear you i can okay. hear you okay thank you ma'am i want to ask you some question can i yeah okay what of you so would you like to answer Sorry? What topics would you like you... to answer? Uh, you can ask me any questions. You can pose also. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Okay. Uh, first of all, how would you define happiness? Okay. Uh, if you think uh, what is happiness, First of all, I can say, and I also I want to say that uh, happiness means free from, uh, stay free from sadness. Because uh, because uh, we think that uh, we if we stay free from uh, free from sadness, uh, so I think uh, we define it uh, and we call that 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 is happiness. Okay, and. Um, if we feel uh, jo uh, joyful or if we stay joyful and if we have any uh, even uh, if we have any problem or more uh, many problem but um, we can uh, if we can feel some uh, uh, some things or some sides are uh, well and that uh, mm -hmm. then we can feel happiness and we can say uh, happily i think uh, and okay yeah. ma'am thank you for your answering but i have a definition of happiness can i share you okay. yeah of course that's okay yep. it is uh, i collect from google can i okay okay yeah. happiness is an em emotional state categorized mm -hmm. by feeling of joy satisfaction contentment and fulfillment the blends of the blends of emotion everyone express both positive and negative emotion feelings and modes happiness is generally linked to expressing more positive feeling than negative can you can agree with me ma'am can you agree with me hello ma'am yeah i agree with you actually i saw that and i know i know that uh, because uh, be, uh, before our uh, starting our the uh, session i googled it okay ma'am uh, please uh, i notice your uh, i feel your uh, intention please please ma'am okay do you think happiness is connected with health sorry can you say it again okay question number two question number two. Oh, okay question number two do you think happiness is connected to work yeah i think uh somehow somehow uh happiness is connected to wealth uh but it's and not entirely connected to wealth i don't think that uh and uh, if you if you don't have much money, fame, or another thing, if you can uh, you can live uh, hap uh, happily, I think. So it's not entirely connected to this, but uh, somehow and uh, somehow connected. Okay, ma'am. Hello, ma Hello. Okay, you can ask me now. Okay, ma'am. I have a, uh, I have an opinion. If you ask yeah. this question, the question is, do you think happiness is coming to well? I have an answer. Health is the root of all happiness. Hello, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. Yeah. 
okay you know health is the root of all happiness if you are healthy you are happy in some cases and if you are sick then you are unhappy right ma'am can you repeat it again actually i can't hear you ma'am yeah okay ma'am okay health is the root of all happiness if you are healthy you are happy in some cases and if you are sick then you are unhappy it's right yeah. ma'am it is right yeah yeah it's yeah. right and i agree with you highly agree with you okay ma'am okay my next question is do you think happiness is connected to love yeah of course happiness is connected to love actually uh, uh i i want to mean i want to mean that uh, love means not only uh, re, uh, relations with a uh, with a girl uh, uh, among among a girl or a boy is not uh, not uh, it's it's not it uh, actually uh, love means uh, it can be with a uh, family members or another person or another thing it can be anything okay so uh, happiness is entirely connected to love if you um, uh, you can uh, you can do everything by this love by love okay so okay. I, that's why i think uh, love uh, happiness is entirely connected to love Okay, ma'am. Okay, I have an opinion. Can I share you? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. If you ask, if you ask uh, this question, uh, I have to say, of course. I think the happiness thing is associated with love. I yeah. don't know how happy you would be if you don't have her love. Yes, sir. Okay, sir. Uh, okay, ma'am. Mm, I want to ask you next question. What things make you happy? Uh, actually, uh, many things can make me happy. When I uh, actually when uh, when I uh, feel any sad you know, or I feel loneliness, at that time. Uh, not only at the time many times or uh, many times uh, many things uh, be, uh, many things be, uh, in my uh, uh, many things there are actually can make me happy like uh, when i i can help any person or a, anyone uh, a, anyone feel happy for uh, for getting getting my help or another things by this another things uh, which is uh, happened by by me and uh, when i uh, when i see uh, actually many things can make me help uh, happy and then uh, when i see any uh, when i watch any uh, serial not only serial uh, songs and then a uh, feel movie and some uh, some having may uh, having fun making jokes can may uh, these are can make me uh, happy okay ma'am yeah. uh, i think i you highly any, agree okay, with you, yeah, you can share it. yeah okay but i have a um, opinion can i share you yeah okay if you ask me the question i have to yeah. say of course my success make me happy my success make me happy and your success make me happy and other success make me happy the good yeah, news yeah. of others the good news of yeah. others make me happy the love of others make me happy and i will be happy if someone else is good you know ma'am yeah your answer is so good actually really i agree with you and okay uh, well, okay I really my, like it. 
Okay, thank you, ma'am. Thank you so much. Uh, I wanna ask you next question. Can I ask you? Yeah. You okay, ma'am. Why do you, why do some people find it difficult to achieve happiness? What yeah, will be your that's an, um, uh, that's an important and very important question. And thank you for asking me these questions. First of all, I want to say that uh, there are uh, different types of uh, people in the world. Uh, many people or most of the people um, can earn many, uh, can earn much money or they can, uh, they want to, uh, they want to do any, um, uh, many things and can get, uh, uh, um, they uh, they want to be successful in their life and uh, many people want uh, more and more actually our life is so short okay so yeah, in yeah. our short life uh, we can earn more and more if we have uh, many things uh, to providing uh, for providing our uh, our life but uh, uh, even then, we can earn a lot of things, a lot of money, a lot of uh, fame and success. Actually, yeah, I can. Uh, I want to say that uh, success is most important for life. But uh, we, uh, uh, when we uh, we uh, we are successful, uh, even then we can get more things. That's why uh, most of the people can find uh, happiness is so difficult in our life. Um, it can uh, it can make uh, people it can make people uh, people life so difficult. And even then, uh, if, if, for this reason, many people uh, commit suicide. Right? Yeah. Yeah, man. Okay. It's yeah. horrible. So, uh, uh, I what think, do you think that? What do you think really, about I, this question? Okay, I think also, I think also, uh, okay, actually, happiness is definite. Happiness, uh, the definition of happiness is very difficult. Uh, it's very to yeah. person to person. You know, ma'am, yeah. my happiness is my only mine, and your happiness is only yours. How can you have yeah. it? I don't know. I I I I know why uh, how I have it, yeah, ma'am. So yeah. it's very difficult, but everyone try to be happy and live in happiness, or uh, try to be other uh, try uh, to other happy. Okay, ma'am. Yeah. Sir. Okay, I think <coughs> we we take a long time. Okay, I think uh, we have finished now. Can you, can I? Okay. Uh, okay, today was just great. And our uh, asking and uh, giving your opinion was just great. Your idea was great. Okay, ma'am. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you for okay. your joining. Thank you for your kindness. Okay, ma'am. Okay. Allah Hafiz. Can you finish now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Allah Hafiz. Okay, Allah Hafiz. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum.